Hi everybody, this is David Bai, VP of Marketing for Jethead Development. We're here at the CES Show 2012, and I'm here to give you a quick update on the deployment status of the RVU technology. Uh, we're on the Entropic booth, who are kindly hosting the DirecTV system demonstration, which uses a combination of DirecTV hardware, developed by Pace, and software from DirecTV and Jethead Development. So here we have the now in production and deployed DirecTV HR34 home media server. It's a five tuner DVR box um, and it basically pulls all the DirecTV content into the home and acts as a home media center uh, distributing the content to the RView clients around the home. So if a new customer comes along and installs this box and happens to have an RView enabled client in the home, DirecTV will install the main server box and provide the customer at the appropriate points in the home with converter boxes like this one to add Ethernet devices to the Mocha network. So in this case, we have a client which would potentially be in the second room of the home, which is a Samsung TV with the RView functionality built in. So DirecTV would uh, check the Mocha connection to the second room. They would put this converter in behind the TV to convert to Ethernet and the Ethernet cable goes directly into the television. So it's a no set-top box solution for the RVU client. They will also provide this new RC70 remote control to give the user a familiar remote control with which to control the DirecTV experience. Interestingly, Samsung has chosen to um, treat the RVU server source as a, an input to the television. So if I pull up the sources of content on the TV, you'll see their TV, you'll see RView, you'll see PC, and you'll see the various HDMI inputs that uh, you know devices could potentially be connected to. So the RView server just looks like an input to the TV and will be treated as such. So what I'm able to do, since we're already playing video in the RView experience, uh, because that input is selected. I can use the remote control to pull up the guide. I can scroll the guide. I can select a new channel. And so on. I can pull up the playlist. And in this case we have five items in the playlist. So really you have the full DirecTV experience on the client device with none of the hardware cost, which is a fantastic cost saving to DirecTV. It's also a much more convenient uh, setup for the consumer. There's much less hardware, much less wiring, and it's an overall simpler system without any compromise to the experience. Of course, our view provides a pixel accurate uh, user experience. So DirecTV's uh, guide data and all the associated content within it is exactly represented on the client as it would have been on a DirecTV set-top box, uh, which obviously gives consistent experience and that's uh, of great value to DirecTV. So that's the new RC70 remote, the Samsung TV, which is now in production. And uh, what I've also got in the setup here is a second Samsung TV with our view inside. But what I'm going to show you is that it, it is the solution where uh, the television in the third or fourth room doesn't have RView inside. So in this case, certainly the TV can connect to the RView source directly, but I've chosen instead to connect it to HDMI 1, and what we have connected to HDMI 1 is something you're all familiar with. It's the uh, Pace DirecTV C30 RView client set-top box, which has been RView certified. This is the box that contains all the Jethead uh, RView client software. Um, we would control this set-top box using the standard, in this case, uh, RC65 set, um, remote control. So I can hit the guide, and you see exactly the same guide. I can hit the program list. You'll see the five items in the list as we saw on the other client. So everything will look identical on this client set-top box as it did on the client TV. And this, of course, is the 
is uh, exactly what the plan was. Um, if I do some scrolling, you can see the scroll performance on the set-top box. Um, if I do a channel change, you can see the channel change time, and so on. So that's a quick update of the technology on display here at the uh, Entropic booth. That's the DirecTV technology. The uh, HMC server and the Samsung TV are now fully deployed in a number of markets in the US. And at the show, Samsung did announce that all their TV models in 2012 will contain the RView functionality, which is a great boost to the RView community. Uh, DirecTV will be taking the home media center nationwide here early in the this uh, in early in 2012 and have a plan to deploy the next version of this set-top box uh, this is called the C30 the next one would be the C31 uh, sometime here in the second quarter uh, so that um, people with out our view compatible televisions can use thin client set-top box technology to get direct TV content around their home Thanks for listening. This is David Bai, VP of Marketing for Jethead Development at CES 2012.